Hey, we got a new trailer reaction for you. Are we going to be two wild and crazy guys? I know we're going to get a little sweaty about it. Yeah, so pre-recorded from our living room, it's Saturday night. Trailer reaction. It's the Cinefanatics with Robert Adams, Chris Adams, their brothers, and now the Cinefanatics. Welcome to the Cinefanatics. My name, you've actually already heard it. They announced it. It's down here. Yeah, it's, just read them. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, we got a trailer for Saturday night. Uh, this apparently is a... Kind of like a biopic of like the first taping or the first broadcast of the original Saturday Night Live show back in 1975. I've heard like a lot of like random casting on this, which is all kinds of crazy and weird and out there. And I'm curious to see how this is actually going to look. Yeah, the cast I've seen so far looks pretty good. So I'm excited to see them kind of in action as the real life people in the trailer. So. Yeah, let's get into this. Hey, free comedy show, plenty of seats, plenty of tickets left, guys. Free show. Finn Wolfhard. <laughs> so, big night. Hmm. Look, my name is Lauren Michaels. I'm the producer of Saturday Night. The whole night. Yeah, the whole night. Chevy Chase, Gilda Radner, Dan Ayika. How the fuck do you pronounce this? <laughs> <laughs> that you sounds know, like I was you. Thinking, yeah. Why don't we punt? We should run the dress rehearsal right. and claw back a Cooper win next Saturday. Mm -hmm. We can't, Dick. It's a live show. We're just not ready. Doesn't matter that we're ready. It matters that it's 11:30. That's when we go on. Lauren, all I'm trying to do is give you advice. Wow, they look pretty good. Mainly yours. Yeah. Sorry, was that a threat? Look around, Lauren. You haven't locked the script. Your crew is in open rebellion. Fuck you. Fuck you. I definitely fuck you. <laughs> the writers on the 17th floor tied a belt around Big Bird's neck and hung him from my dressing room door. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's such a great Jim Henson. Yeah. Ensemble. Oh, is this an ensemble? Really? Yeah. Yeah. NBC makes more money playing reruns of The Tonight Show. NBC is lucky to have something as relevant as this show. Lauren, they don't even want it. That's logical, Dick. That's why they're paying us all to be here. I mean, Lauren, 90 minutes of live television by a group of 20-year-olds who've never made anything. Do you ever stop and wonder why they said yes? A counterculture show starring total unknown. This looks great. With zero narrative wow. and even less structure. Oh, what the fuck? Oh. They want you to fail. Am I still in the show? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Sorry, I tripped over my penis. <laughs> that was so Chevy Chase. That would be a Chevy Chase, yeah. That was such a Chevy Chase thing to do. Uh, that looks really good. They nailed it. I don't know if you've seen lately, but uh, like at least this past season of Saturday Night Live, they've been doing every once in a while the... Uh, when the show actually goes live, they will broadcast the entire like monologue mm -hmm. live on YouTube. Yeah, and it's kind of cool because that gives you a little bit of insight of seeing behind the scenes how they switch off from like the cold open to the monologue to the first sketch. You see like the director's booth. You see, yeah, you see all the stage hands moving everything around for that first sketch or coming off of the cold open. Like I love the behind the scenes stuff. That's what this is doing, but it's showing us like that behind the scenes back in 1975 yeah when they didn't have everything down smooth like they do nowadays like you go and you watch that and they're moving yeah they are mo they've got everything they just they just got it rolling super smooth like butter they definitely probably did not have that back then they were just learning this is going to be a very interesting movie what a cast too what an incredible cast i mean the fact that you got willem dafoe jk simmons was in there mm -hmm. uh cooper hoffman the second coming of philip seymour hoffman obviously um and then of course like everybody who's playing the the cast just actually kind of they really look the parts i like it like a lot of them are like pretty much unknowns i know uh what's 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 his name that played riddler on gotham yeah he's playing chevy chase is it like Corey michael smith something yeah like that? he's playing chevy chase 
but for the most part, I don't know who a lot of the other ones are. I know, like, I recognized uh, Rachel Sennett real quick. So I know she's in there. But a lot of the other new people, I'm not that familiar I believe, with them. I believe Lamore Morris from uh, yeah, from New Girl. Yeah, he's playing, it looked like he was playing Garrett Morris, which mm -hmm. I don't believe there's actually a relation there. Comments will let us know. Yeah. Uh, there's not. <laughs> um, that too. Yeah, so it looks interesting. I want to see what they do with this. This, for the most part, could, I could see if this does very well. Award contention? This could be an award contention. I mean, it's coming out right in the right time. I mean, October 11th is the release date, so... Mm -hmm. Uh, I think this is going to be great. I think it looks it looks fantastic. It looks uh, it's I believe it's Jason Reitman, right? Yes. Yeah. So you know that you've got a good like balanced comedic drama mind behind it, mm -hmm. and so I think you've really just got great material to work with. You've got a colorful cast. Everyone looks like they're nailing the roles of the of the people they're playing. Um, I think my, uh, my bets it's going to be good. Yeah, I can't wait for this. So. Anyways, uh, what did you think of this trailer or this reaction? Let us know down below in the comments. While you're down there, make sure you hit that like button and make sure you hit subscribe. Come follow us for everything that we are doing here. Follow us on social media. We are at The Cine Fanatics on Twitter and Instagram and TikTok. You can follow me personally at RCA Reacts on Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, Letterbox, and YouTube.com slash at RCA Reacts. And you can follow me at Chris Adams MLP on Twitter, Instagram, and Letterbox, as well as Twitch.tv slash Chris Adams MLP. Anyways, that's going to do it for this reaction. Thank you for watching. We'll see you on the next one. Chris, you're a dirty slut. <laughs> Goodbye.